So have you or another content creator you know been either demonetized or completely canceled from YouTube? Well, stick around and watch because I have a solution for you. Now, a lot of people watching this might either have their own YouTube channel that they rely heavily on, including for their income, or have a lot of creators that they follow who are otherwise demonetized or cut off of YouTube completely. And, you know, I know this has been hard on a lot of people, but I do have a solution. As it turns out, there is a new YouTube killer on the market, and it's called Odyssey, spelled O-D-Y-S-E-E. -E. Yeah, I'm going to take a while to learn how to spell that one, too. Don't worry. So basically, Odyssey is a new video platform that works a whole lot like YouTube, except it does not censor your content and does not demonetize your content. And the reason it does this is because it's based on the library or LBRY blockchain. And the way it's structured is you can't really have just one central authority, just like YouTube, that can go in and directly control your content. You actually own your content. So any content creator or content consumer that has been negatively affected by YouTube's new content policies and algorithms should definitely check out Odyssey for three big reasons. So the first reason is that it's decentralized. And what this means is not only will Odyssey not censor content creators, but they actually can't. This is because Odyssey is built on the library blockchain and all content is stored on a whole bunch of different computers across the internet in a decentralized manner where no one server, actor, or anything can just come in and say, I don't like that, that gets taken down. It gets off the blockchain. Now, because of the way this works, as well as the team behind Odyssey's commitment to free speech, you won't have to worry about posting a wrong or controversial opinion or just something that happens to not be in the favor of the algorithm that day and then completely lose everything you worked so hard for. That's like the number one reason why you should look into something like Odyssey if you're a content creator on YouTube because otherwise it can be a really risky business. There have been some people who have built their whole lives around this and then over time or just overnight, they just lose everything. Okay, so the second reason is monetization. Uh, YouTube, unfortunately, makes you wait until you have at least 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 hours of watch time before you're able to actually monetize your content, before you can put ads on there, before you can have super chats or other subscriptions or things like that. Now, with Odyssey, that isn't really a problem. So Odyssey works on a credit system where anyone can essentially tip anyone on the platform and no one can stop it. So for example, say you have a very popular channel and you tell people to, hey, please donate and whatever. Instead of trying to do that through ads or instead of going through like a Patreon or something like that, you can actually tell people, hey, tip me right here on the video thing. In fact, there's a little button down at the bottom. You can just hit support and then there you go. You can leave a tip and no one can stop it. And you can also paywall your videos. And this is like premium subscriber content, except anyone can just buy one particular video of yours and that's it. And you can set the price at just like one cent or a couple cents or something really small so that you still have a lot of people watching, but just about anyone can just click a button and then there we go. And then you get paid. And of course, the biggest part about this is anyone can do this. You don't have to reach some sort of threshold. You don't have to qualify. You don't have to be advertiser friendly. You don't have to do anything. Anyone can get monetized through this basic uh, credit system of being able to tip or put a little paywall behind that. Now this is a great avenue for people who have controversial topics they talk about or just aren't advertiser friendly or whatever else and still wanna be able to monetize their content and have their listeners and their audience actually help them out and support them. You can actually do that. And don't forget, you can still have whatever deal with your own advertisers you want that you already have for referral codes or for selling merchandise or whatever else you want to do. There just isn't that arbitrary barrier to entry and it doesn't all go through you two and you get to actually keep 100% of the payments and the tips you get and whatever other deals you work out on your own. It's your own business, your own life. You do it the way you want to. And finally, you don't have to be afraid of ever losing everything. 
Now, different sites and platforms come and go and their policies might change and things like that. And that's exactly why we're in the situation to begin with is because YouTube was a certain way in the beginning and then changed everything. And then you could lose your entire video catalog, your entire everything. But the way Odyssey works is you actually have control and ownership over everything, over all your own content, over all your own subscribers, over all your own money that you get from this. So for whatever reason, if someone just takes down the Odyssey site or some evil person gets control of it and starts trying to do crazy things, you can just take all your content and just export it to another filter, another site that watches the same library blockchain and all that content, and then guess what? You're already back online. You have all your same videos are still there. All your subscribers are still there and all the money that you received is still all there. That's because Odyssey never controlled any of it. It was just out on a decentralized blockchain. You had the keys to it and they just provided a little lens to look into it. But if the lens goes away, if something bad happens, you can import it into another site. For example, there's another one called library.tv, L-B-R-Y.tv. That's a little bit more for advanced users, but it's very similar. And it's the same thing. All your channels, everything, you can just use both. And if one goes down for whatever reason, if one goes in a bad direction, you can just use the other one. And then anyone can essentially make something. And if you want to get really hardcore, there's even a desktop client that you can download that just runs on its own and no one can take it down. And that's kind of more for advanced users anyway. Yeah, so what are you waiting for? Go give Odyssey a try. Go use the link down over here and get started. And yeah, see what cool stuff you can find. Also, let me know in the comments if you've tried this or another decentralized or otherwise censorship resistant or whatever term they use uh, video platform before and what your experiences were and, you know, what could be improved and what still keeps you around with YouTube, right? I also want to know that. So let me know in the comments below. Uh, make sure to subscribe to this channel for more awesome stuff like this. And I'll see you over at Odyssey.